Hi, I'm Lisa, the Goodwill Gal. This afternoon, I'm going to a backyard barbecue and I'm taking with me a Mediterranean pasta salad. And I'm gonna share the recipe with you. First, I have a package of three cheese tortellini and I've already cooked it according to the package directions. But what I did was when I drained it, I saved a half a cup of the water that comes out of this because we're gonna use it later with the dressing. Now you're gonna need one cup of cherry tomatoes. I saw this little trick on a video, I think on YouTube, and um, it's really an easy way to slice the tomatoes. You just put, it, put them on a base of a lid and then put another lid on top and just start cutting through them. Now I have one can of artichoke hearts and I've already chopped them into little pieces. I'm just gonna toss them in here. And one can of sliced olives. You can buy whole olives and slice them yourself, but I already bought them because I wanna spend time doing other things. Now I'm gonna use one avocado. My husband really likes avocados, so I actually put two in the salad, but you can use one or two or how many you like. The last thing I'm going to add to this bowl is some crumpled feta, three quarter cup. And you can add red peppers, cucumbers in here and it makes a really nice crunchy salad. But my family's really picky and they don't like to eat that. So I'm just going to stop here with the rest of the ingredients. Okay, so I set aside my bowl of pasta, and now I'm gonna make the dressing. For that, you're gonna need three tablespoons of balsamic vinegar. Okay, next is two tablespoons of orange juice. And now one quarter cup olive oil. So now we're gonna use one tablespoon of Italian seasoning and one teaspoon of minced garlic and two cloves of garlic. It's about one teaspoon. I know because I Googled it. And the last ingredient I'm gonna put in the dressing is one half teaspoon of paprika. And now I'm just gonna whisk it together. All right, so I've got it all whisked. And I'm just gonna pour it into the um, bowl. Now remember I had the pasta water, half a cup that I had you set aside. And I'm going to add that to the pasta right now. And some salt and pepper to taste. And now I'm going to toss it. So I put some plastic wrap over the bowl and I'm gonna put it in the refrigerator for at least an hour before I go to the barbecue. And I'm also gonna take this container of feta with the remaining cheese in it. So when I get to the barbecue, I'm just gonna sprinkle it on top for presentation and it's gonna taste spectacular. For more summer recipes like this, subscribe to my channel. We'll see you later.